The Benue State Government has launched the distribution of federal government palliatives across all the 276 council wards in the state, 23 local government areas. Speaking at the flag of event in Makodi, the Executive Secretary of the State Emergency Management Agency, James Ayopu, said the items which include fertilizers, gari and corn are intended for the vulnerable populations, particularly the elderly, widows, the poorest of the poor orphans, government school students, and the physically challenged. Ayopo expressed gratitude to the governor for his unwavering commitment to humanitarian efforts, as well as the federal government for its support. The politics we are supporting today came from the federal government to National Emergency Management Agency, NEMA. The total number of items to be distributed includes 17,000 940 bags of maize, 50 kg, and 4,132 bags of gari, 25 kg. Each council ward will be taking 55 bags of maize and 15 bags of gari. Total, 80 bags per each council ward. We will commence with zone A today. The 25th July, zone B will receive its parities on the 26th of July. And finally, zone C on the 27th of July also. The chairman of Gwell West Local Government, Honorable Henry Agbar, has distributed fertilizers to the council ward, warning the local residents not to sell these products as the government will punish anyone caught doing so. 600 bags of this assorted fertilizer and uh, taking delivery of 1,200 bags of maize and garlic put together. And we hope to continue with um, lifting them from SEMA as from Tuesday this week. And by the time we take delivery of all the food items, we will still call the people across the 15 council roads and as well as no indigents and then do the distribution in the local government sector right here so that the fertilizer will be given to them. And uh, we, want, we want to warn that nobody should divert this fertilizer and sell it. If we get any news of diversion, we will arrest such a person and the person will be prosecuted. Uh, we want to, I want to say that uh, the, uh, the Nigerian youth should exercise some patience and the federal government is working around the clock to ensure that youths are being carried along. The president of the federal republic is working around the clock to ensure that jobs are created. So it's a matter of time. We, I know the hardship is much, but they should exercise some patience and see what the president and the, 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 respect, the various state governors will do to reduce the rates of unemployment. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.